Hello everybody. Welcome to Lighthearted Life and Collectibles. You're looking at baby Gemma. She's going to get changed out of her Christmas outfit. And this is going to be a quick video. I'm not going to do any editing, so it is just going to be uploaded as is. Uh, because I got to go to church tonight and I got to go pick up my mom and take her. So this is going to be just really quick. We're going to get Gemma changed out of this Christmas outfit into a very cute sleeper set in purple. And Jenny actually sent this in her box opening as well. Well, not the diaper and the socks, but the little sleeper. But I wanted to talk to y'all about my new job. I haven't really revealed that, but... I just recently, about two and a half to three months ago, started subbing for the school system in my area. And um, one day while I was subbing, the principal of the school came up to me and asked me if I would like a full-time position as a paraprofessional, and I accepted. So... I started working there, and three days later, I came down with the flu and COVID. Then it was Christmas break. So, um, today was my first day back after all that. But I have to say, I really love the job, and um, I'm really excited to be working there. And, of course, it's great to have hobby money. <laughs> but, um I'm enjoying it. I work with kindergarten through second grade. I gotta swear this buttoned. Oh, it does button in the back. So I'm enjoying it a lot. Like I really love it and it's a very rewarding and fun job. So um just wanted to let y'all know that. So that's that combined with me being sick and then my mom getting sick and all that going on. Um, I haven't been uploading quite as much as well as I just kind of got tired of spending all that time uploading and, you know, and not being anywhere near the 4,000 watch hours that YouTube wants me to be at. So I just quit trying to put in all the effort because it was taking all the fun out of it, trying to worry about when and what to upload and all this and then YouTube only wants to push my shorts videos which doesn't give me watch time but yet if my shorts videos were counted I would have had more than enough watch time so I just don't like that I don't think it's fair and therefore I'm just going to enjoy my hobby and if I get to 4,000 watch hours I do and if I don't I don't I'm not going to worry with it so anyways we're going to put this purple cloth diaper on little Miss Gemma I'm ordering her a new body tomorrow because this body that she's on is not, it's, it's bigger. It's not the size she's supposed to have because she's supposed to be a 22 inch baby and she is 25 inches on this body. And I'll show you another reason why I don't like it. She always looks up. I'm going to raise this up for a minute. When you sit her up, this is what her head always does. It's like she's always looking straight up at the ceiling. You have to lean her way forward just for her to appear to be looking um, at a normal angle. Otherwise, it, she's looking straight up all the time. And I just really don't like that. So, I'm also going to change the weighting in her head. Because I feel like it's too heavy. In the back but it's also this body like I don't care how you adjust the stuffing in the body or whatever I mean you can only stuff her so much and see this is what her head does all the time no matter what so that is why I'm gonna actually get her a 22 inch body like her kit is supposed to be on and a different kind of body and I'm gonna reweight her head so, I'm going to let her wear all this three to six months as much as I can until her new body comes in because I know that's going to change her size 
she will probably be in uh, like three months or maybe just uh, maybe not zero to three months though I mean, she might still be able to wear three to six, but we're probably going to be looking at like regular just three months or bigger zero to three because it's going to change her length because this body has her. When I put her side by side with Skylar, I'm going to get him up here just to show y'all. She is exactly the same length as him and she is not supposed to be. <laughs> so that is not her correct body. And I just want her to be on her correct body so that, um, I mean, his sculpt is bigger than her as far as like the limb girth and stuff. So that's not what I mean. But look, she's as long as he is when you put their knees together, except for his feet point downward and hers doesn't. So when you put their knees like this, She's not supposed to be the size of Maddie because when you go on McPherson's and stuff and look up Huxley, it says 22 inch. And she's way bigger on this body. So I think that's the issue with why I can never um, get her adjusted right because she's just not on the right size body. So we're going to put these little gray and striped socks on her they got like purple orange and yellow or actually that's well it's almost the color of my shirt but it's got more of a pink so i would say it's more like a neon pink so we're gonna put these on her to help keep her little tootsies warm and then we have this three to six month purple and white striped sleeper yeah when i get her body in a little best one keeps falling over. When I get her little her body in, I'm gonna do a video changing her into the new body. So I always like to watch stuff like that. And also I think people like watching stuff like that because they like the learning experience um, of watching people change the bodies out and all that kind of stuff. Because it can be kind of scary when you're changing a reborn baby body out for the first time and you've never done it and I mean I know how I felt the first time I did it I had a Coco Malu and I did not like the original body that it came with it was the correct body because it was the kit's body but I did not like it for this very reason the Coco Malu's head always went backward too and all of her weighting was in the front of her head. Although this baby feels like it's got some weight in the back. Um, the Coco Malu I had, which was what Everly was as a baby. I know all her weighting was in the front. And her head would still do that. It looked like she had a broken neck all the time. <laughs> and Gemma just looks like she's staring at all the ceiling fans in the room all the time. So, um... I'm hoping this new body will correct that and that we won't have that issue. And like I said, I'm going to make sure that her head is weighted the way it needs to be. And then that's a perfect excuse to go shopping, right? Because she's going to need a new wardrobe because she's probably going to wear zero to three months or three months. Because there's, there's no way she's going to be able to wear this three to six months. Um, after I get that new 22 inch body on her, which is what she's supposed to be anyway. Isn't that right? So that's what I'm supposed to be anyhow. And that's supposed to be 25 inches. It's supposed to be 22 inches. So she's going to change. Um, I'm not going to change her age drastically because, you know, I still want her. To be able to like role play that she's crawling and sitting up and stuff. So I'm going to change her age from eight months to like six months. So that's what I'm going to do. She's just going to go down in age just a little bit. Um, just to kind of fit the difference in the size of her body. So there she is all dressed up. 
Here, her, here's her little babas. We'll sit her up with her stuff. All right, there she is with her babas. And let's get her a little headband, even though we're going to bed. Or she's going to be going to bed. Mommy's going to church. We're still going to get her a cute little headband. Isn't she adorable? Look at all that cuteness. Her so precious. So yeah, I cannot wait to share Gemma's new look with y'all. And um, I'll be doing that video really soon. I'm going to get the body ordered tomorrow. So McPherson's is usually pretty quick about shipping stuff out. So she'll probably have her new body by probably Monday or Tuesday of next week. And when I get it in, I will share it with y'all. But that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed seeing Gemma getting changed out of her Christmas outfit and getting changed into her jammies. And there will be some pictures coming up for Instagram and Facebook and also for my community wall really, really soon, like probably later tonight. Bye, y'all. We love you.